Thanks for joining me guys for another video beer review. Heading back over to the Scormont Abbey to take a look at a beer from Chimay. And this time it is the Grand Reserva or Chimay Blue. A Belgian strong ale weighing in at 9% ABV in a 750ml offering this time. Cajun cork again. Um, there is some print on the back there but it's so bloody small. I'm not even going to bother with this. Um, for me, my personal preference is probably their best beer that they do. Um, I absolutely love it. I've had it quite a few times but never actually turned the camera on to do it. So here we go. Yeah, I picked this up, got it from Amazon. Yeah, it's, it's a bit of an, an odd one, where is you sort of like, where do you park it in beer styles? Because it obviously falls short at 9% ABV of being a quad. And of course, it's not a double because they've got their double, haven't they? The Rouge. So, yeah, it's a Belgian strong dark ale. We'll leave it at that. Uh, beer in the glass then, yeah, lovely mahogany colour to it. Um, bit of carbonation moving up on a spacious, more or less two finger. It's as good as white, I'd say. It ain't does though, it ain't does white. Let's get a nose. Again, you, you, you go down that avenue of dark fruits, sweet, sort of like molasses. Very floral. Yeah, lovely, lovely aroma to it. Let's go in on it. Cheers. Mm. It's amazing. It really is amazing. I could say it is, it is their best um, core beer. That's a better word of putting it. I know they've got the variations of of um, this style of beer, oaked and barrel aged and all that. Never had the pleasure of trying anything like that, but I've heard good things about them beers. But for their, their run of the mill stuff, yeah, it's the best for me. Again, you've got that lovely mixture of fruit, fruit cake, spice, loads of sugar, yeasty, floral, and very very drinkable at 9%. Uh, body on it, I mean it's not the it's not, not the most luxurious of bodies I must admit for um, a Belgian strong dark ale uh, so I'm gonna just probably place it just flirting on under medium maybe you've got that sort of yeah the classic Belgian yeasty characteristic to it all mixed in with fruit sugar maybe raisins Magnificent stuff. <laughs> I will get my arse into gear and try some of the, the aged stuff one day. I mean, even even with that, that head, it's got a little bit of foamy spiciness to it. But yeah, all the same, top class Trappist stuff right there from Chime. Um Probably my favourite Trappist beer, out of Belgium anyway. Um, I just think that the majority of their beers are absolutely tip top. Cheap as chips. Um, not so much in this country I must admit and it's going to be a little bit tricky now in this 
this climate that we find ourselves in where we can't sort of get them beers from, from across the pond now, which is a bit sort of disappointing. Hopefully that will be rectified because, yeah, I mean, something like this on, on the websites that I normally go on, um, you're looking at about five euros for a big 750. Um, so it's, it's an absolute steal. Um, lovely stuff. So hopefully, fingers crossed, they get that sorted. Uh, Chimay, Grand Reserve, 9% ABV, Belgian Strong, Dark Ale, fantastic stuff. I'll see you on my next one. Ciao.